Okay, another quick thought about technique today. Dozen a day, pink book, group one, exercise number eight, which is called deep breathing. Let's do it. Okay, I think the exercise should be played like this. I'll play it first. Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, four, off. So what happens there? Let's break it down. The first two notes, the C and the E, I feel like they should be played as if they're joined by a slur. So on the C, you drop you allow your wrist to drop the weight a tiny bit, you allow it to drop, prepare the E, not too much, you just prepare the E a tiny bit, and as you play the E, see you join it in legato with both the fingers and the wrist, the wrist is coming up, one, two, three, four. Now, What's that making you do? It's making you rise in the wrist, which means that you have the power of gravity now. You can now drop, you can release that E and drop on the first chord. You drop on the first chord. That chord lasts for four beats. Clearly on beat one, one, you're dropping your weight. Again, you're allowing the wrist to drop. Over the course of beat two, three, four, you're rising again with your wrist because you want to release that chord gently with your wrist. And now again, you have the power of gravity. You can drop again on the second chord. That second chord now lasts only for two beats, beat one and two, which means that if you drop on beat one, you only have beat two to come up with your wrist and release it one two now the last two chords last for beat three and four one beat each which means that you're gonna have to drop on the beat release on the off beat drop on the beat release on the off beat three and four and and the last chord is a final semi brief you just drop for the four beats and gently release two three four off so the exercise is teaching you to let go of your weight and release it but with a gentle action of the wrist at an increasing rate and also is teaching you to join two notes one two three four with a gentle legato of the fingers and the wrist one two three four so once again one two three four one two three four one two three and four and one two three four off it is so important to to be able to allow the wrist to drop the weight into the keys and to gently release. And that's all for now. Thanks for watching. See you at the next one.